What's up guys, welcome back to another episode. Today we are gonna be planning for a trip. Matt and I are gonna be spending the night out at Lake Tawakany State Park tomorrow night. So go over to his channel. He's gonna film all that stuff. It's gonna be pretty fun. We're gonna catch a lot of fish. That's the goal. We never do, but it's okay. But I bought a tent, bought some other goodies. So I'm gonna show you stuff right now. Hope you enjoy the video. All right, so we just got back from Academy. We picked up this tent right here. It's a Magellan Bass Drop tent. It's 12 feet long, seven feet wide, sleeps five people it shows. It also says it's 62 inches tall. That's what it looks like. So it should be plenty of room for Matt and I. We're gonna have some air mattresses in there as well. So here's a few more camping supplies that we picked up. We bought two twin Magellan outdoor air beds. They're 74 inches long by 39 inches wide and eight and a half inches tall. That was $9.99. Then we picked up a hand pump. It's an Intex double quick two hand pump. That was $10. And then Matt already had a sleeping bag, so he didn't need one. I bought this Magellan. It's a rated 45 degrees for $9.99. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and put this tent together. I'm gonna see how long it's gonna take me to do it. So I'm gonna go ahead and put you guys on time lapse. Let's get busy. Alright guys, so it took about 10 minutes total to put this up by myself. It'd be a lot quicker out there because I'll have Matt's help doing it, so it'll be able to cut the time down in half, but I like the design. I did not put the rain fly on top right now. The rain fly is just what covers from all the rain coming at the top, but it has plenty of room inside. It's got a lot of netting on it, which allows a lot of airflow through it, so I'm pretty excited with this buy. All right, so now we're inside the tent. You can see there's plenty of room in here. We bought two of the single mattresses, the blow-ups, so they'll easily fit in here. Matt can have one side, I'll have the other. We're brothers, by the way. But I like this design. It's a simple little piece right here you just hook on. It zips down, zips down. Allows plenty of airflow here. That's a lot cooler. Yeah, I know. Uh, it has that on both sides. It has a big uh, section over here for the front door. Same thing like that. You can unzip it. Plenty of airflow on this side as well. And up at the top, all the way over the top. Like I said, you can put the rain fly on there to cover it from rain. I think we're actually supposed to get some rain tomorrow. Next time, me and Matt need to look up the weather before we go camping. It was a random thing. <laughs> but it also comes with two little uh, pouches. Not bad for a $50 tent, $49.99. I'm five foot eight and I have, as you can see, I'm not standing up all the way, so it's probably I don't know, maybe five feet at the at the peak here, but plenty of room down here. Like I said, we'll probably put one air bed this way, one that way, and have a section in the middle where we can just put all of our supplies in. All right, so I'm pretty excited to go fishing at this part of the lake. I haven't been there in probably two years, and I've never spent the night out there, but I'm just getting some of my fishing gear ready to go. Got my knife sheath from Rancho Los Rosales. You see that right there? Tried to open up my knife, I couldn't do it. But, uh... I bought a new lure. I'm gonna hook that onto my little Zepco push button reel. This thing's pretty awesome. It's a little bluegill one, it moves. Should be able to catch a lot of fish with this. 
at least that's what uh, I'm hoping because every time we go fishing I always get skunked but yeah it's gonna be fun check-in time is tomorrow at 2 p.m. and then we have to be out by noon the next day but I think we're gonna get out there a little bit early because I think we can actually go to the at least go inside the state park early do some fishing and then around 2 o'clock go set up the tent and everything I'm not sure if we're gonna bring a little grill or not. They should have a little barbecue pit section out there, but we'll probably bring it anyways, just, just to be safe. All right, so I have my new lure hooked on. Looks pretty realistic to me. It looks like the little bluegill. Hopefully I'll be able to catch some stuff, but if we don't catch anything to eat, we are gonna take some hamburgers and probably hot dogs to cook. And then uh, if we happen to catch any fish, we may cook that as well, so. I don't know, you guys will have to find out. Like I said, Matt will be filming the majority of this trip. I'm also going to be doing some footage for another video, but I don't know. I'm excited. It's going to be fun. Hopefully we catch a lot of fish and have a good time. All right, guys, I'm excited to take this thing out camping for the first time. It costs $10 for us to get in. It's a $10 for a vehicle, five per person. So $10 to get in. Matt was saying that here in Texas that you could buy a year pass for $75. So I think it might be well worth it depending on how this trip goes. But it's something I've been looking forward to, wanting to get out of the house for a while. And now I have a tent. We can finally go tent camp and it be tent trash. So I know a few of you are probably gonna ask, what are we gonna do with the animals? All the animals we stand here, we may take Riley. He's Matt's dog, the oldest one that we have. Um, all the other animals will be fine. The dogs will be fine. So they'll all stay here. We're only be gone maybe a 24 hour time frame overall. I got one of the dogs right here trying to knock my camera over. But yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to this. I haven't been camping probably since I went up to Jason's in Oklahoma a while back. But uh, the last time I was in a tent, it was Jason's $25 tent that he had. And that was probably, like I said, two years ago. So I'm excited to go tent camping again, become tent trash. Uh, I said that because one of our friends growing up, uh, his dad called Jason and I tent trash just as a joke and I thought it was funny. So, um, I don't know. I'm looking forward to it. I have to run into town here in a second to go drop off some shoot dang shirts at the post office. Matt just finished up packaging everything. So, uh, give Matt a, a shout out in the comments saying, thanks Matt for sending out our shirts. But, uh, yeah, look forward to it. Uh, hopefully the weather's not too bad. Like I said, it's supposed to rain a little bit at night. Um, I don't think it's going to be as pretty as the day as it is today. We should have checked it, but we didn't, so it is what it is. But hope you enjoyed this, this video. I'm looking forward to making more camping videos, uh, possibly visiting other state parks uh, around here in the Texas area, uh, maybe some up there in Oklahoma as well. So hope you enjoyed today's video. If you do, go down and smash the like button. Don't forget to go over to the Real Matt Crocker, subscribe to his channel, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.